All right, y'all, it's 2.23 a.m. Best time to hit the gym. I'm like 23 minutes late, but let's go hit it. <laughs> Why is the best time to avoid everybody, man? Especially around New Year's, New Year's resolutioners. Don't know what they're doing. <laughs> no, man, get out of my way. But no, nah, man, all jokes aside, even though I wasn't playing, I'm going to try out this uh, Woke AF. So that's Woke as f you know what I'm saying? Um, I've never had this. It's been out for a while. Bucked up, woke AF, BS, mother, all that stuff, man. They got stuff caught that, man. But yeah, this is a pre-workout for those who don't know. You know, for those who are beginners. I'm not dissing you if you're a beginner. I'm just saying, like, um, stay out the way at the gym. But yeah, we about to take this to see how it work. Woke AF. Okay, that's what it looks like. That's what the scooper looks like. I'm going to take a scoop. And I take mine to the head, which means I scoop it into my mouth and I chase it down with my water. Uh, a lot of people do the shaker and mix it up. I don't like doing that. I like take it to the head. It feel like it hit me uh, faster. So, and yes, this is creatine. I mean, um, pre workout. A lot of people be like, "Oh, you be talking about people that be on roids and you take this and then the third. Dude, these are supplements, bro. These are legal. This is not something that you stick in your a needle and you stick in your butt and some magical things happen. No, this ain't that. <laughs> All right, y'all, we here. I see two cars. Um, A lot of people ask me all the time. So that's my gym right there, goes. I see one car, I see two cars. But uh, a lot of people, which sometimes it'd be one or two cars and it'd still be that one person, you know what I'm saying? But people ask me, what's the problem with you and people in the gym? Like, what's, what's the difference? Dude talking interrupting um dog you go to the gym to work out like you know being in the gym oh i see one dude she come back i think that's that one dude that be talking too much but being in the gym is not and i think he's leaving thank god but uh being in the gym is not half of the battle a lot of people say that it sounds good it's it's something people say uh so i might got some bad news the dude that was driving that car right there he just said, because they was remodeling the gym. So he just said, I'm going to try anyways, because his car might just not work or something. I don't know. But uh, we'll grab my bag. And people didn't know, what I, my New Year's resolution was to keep my car clean and his back getting halfway. No, nah, it ain't where it was. So go look up my New Year's resolution video. If you, I had two bags of trash out of my car because I'm so busy. A lot of people be like, what? Well, Dude, like, a lot of people ain't as busy as me. I, I got, I do 12 and a half hour shifts. But what I was saying was being in the gym. Oh, man, they got cars in there, so. Yeah, I don't know. Being in the gym is not even part of the battle. I took my pre-workout. Probably gonna have to work out at home, do some push-ups and some. I only got one set of 20-pound dumbbells. God dang. And I don't really like showing my house. Because people that might have lived there before me. I don't know where you live at. People down here, they will show up at your house uninvited. <clears throat> crazy. But it's normal to them, so it's not even that crazy. God damn, I don't see nothing on the sign. I'm going to try it. Okay, so they got the sign, and it says phase two of their flooring. They've been fixing the floors. Like, dog, them floors was cool. Like, happy New Year's. Like, it's New Year's. Y'all taking people money. So whatever, man. I'm recording this right here. Man. <sighs> Yeah, man. I can't get in. Probably daytime. I cannot work out in the daytime. I'm a person that actually works out. Literally. Like, God dang. So I'm going back to my car. And I got to go home. I got to work out at home. I got to work. I can't work out in the daytime. Oh, man. It's going to kill me. They don't hurry up with them dang floors. I'm not going to be able to work out until my day off. I work Monday and Tuesday. I'm off Wednesday and Thursday this week. I can work out on those days. People don't understand. This is people's lifestyle, and they're taking people's money. The whole time the gym was closed during quarantine, they was taking people's money. I was paying for that. <laughs> paying for nothing. You know what I'm saying? Got something back, a discount, something. Comment, like, subscribe, share. Holla back at your boy. Peace. Dang. See what I'm saying? Always something. You have to work out or you don't work out. My name Rapping Time Fitness. I can't even get into fitness. Nah, we ain't done. We not done. We not done. Let's ride out. Try to get
Oh, oh no. Copyright. But yeah, let's ride out. I'm gonna talk to y'all a little bit more. Um, for those who are still with me, you know what I'm saying? I can't work out. This ain't no workout video no more. This ain't no pre-workout video. I was supposed to do a pre-workout uh, review of, I'm not sponsored by them, but I do pre-workout reviews here and there and tell people which pre-workout I like and which ones I don't like. As a small YouTuber that's not monetized, um, um, I recommend doing those videos because a lot of my best videos are the ones about reviewing things that I take, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people, oh, you take stuff, so that's like being on Roy's. No, it's not, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I had people say, say that to me before. I'm trying to show y'all the road. Then it's going to be, you know, but it's all good, man. But yeah, man, probably going to do a home workout. I'm not going to film it. But they're robbing us. They're robbing us, man. Because I'm paying every day. I can't even work out and I'm paying every day. I can't work out during the day because people are in the way. People always tell me, oh, well, just tell them to get out your way. You don't get it. I do. They line up. I got to tell 15, 20 people to get out my way because as soon as that person gets out my way, another one comes up. I'm not even saying I'm that impressive, but the thing is, like, my best bench press I haven't done in like half a year. My best bench press was 365 pounds. Uh, my best deadlift was 545. My best squat was back in the days was 555. I ain't nowhere near that right now, so I don't even speak. Y'all never heard me even say that one. Um, the heaviest I've done on camera, deadlift was probably early fives. Late fours, early fives, 495, give or take. Um, the heaviest bench I've done on camera, I think I did 365 on camera. But I did a lot. I did 315, 335, 345 a lot of times for, you know, some reps. Like 275 for like 10 reps, 315 for like 5 by 5 on camera. I got videos of that, you know what I'm saying? People always talk about things. They, they don't listen to what people say. They lift until you see them lifting, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people, they do actually lift what they say. Most of them don't, but a lot of them don't do it right. They cheat. But that ain't even what this about. People always ask me why you can't do as much as you used to. There's multiple reasons, you know, bulking and cutting, losing weight, gaining weight, um, letting myself go weight-wise. Like, this this year, I just ate whatever I wanted. I ain't gonna lie. Now it's time to diet down. Um, but, um, you know, and I'm cool with that because I know how to get the weight off. A lot of people, you don't want to, you don't want to gain weight if you don't know. You never had a successful cut in the, you know, you never had a successful cut, don't go on a crazy bulk. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't even recommend bulking for a beginner anyways. You know, you just started, just just weigh the weight that you weigh and just lift. You know what I'm saying? Learn how to lift. Learn how to lift before you do anything. You know what I'm saying? Form before everything. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like a car crash. I look at it like a car crash. And y'all can hear what I'm saying, but the camera's not focusing at all. But it's all good. I'm trying to drop jewels on you. Um, stop with this QT. Yeah, man, God dang, man. It's 2.48 right now, man. I was supposed to be in there getting it, you know. I feel the pre-workout, you know. By the way, the pre-workout feel like it's good. I usually take Mr. High. Mr. High usually gives me a more a feeling that it's working, but I can't even tell you what, what it's doing, you know what I'm saying? You know, it ain't a pre-workout review unless you're reviewing it while working out. I can tell you how it feels. It feels like it's working. You know, I heard good reviews on it, you know what I'm saying? I heard people tell me, oh, you ever tried this before? I remember when I first tried Mr. High, like, um, a long time ago, somebody had told me about Mr. High, but the guy that was telling me, he wasn't really a lifter, so I wasn't listening to him. But then I tried it, I was like, God dang. <laughs> that shit hit me like a brick, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, man, and people, a lot of people are like, why don't you point the camera at you? Because it's nighttime. Well, it's, it's morning, but it's still dark outside. And for y'all to see me, I would have to turn the car, I would have to turn my lights on the side of my car and drive and talk to y'all like that. And guess what that makes you? It makes you a target for the police. At the end of the day, it's easy to get, you gotta watch out for a lot of things when you work out at this time. You know, you gotta think about it. Ain't that many cars on the road. You know what I'm saying? So, no matter where you live, but ain't that many cars on the road or here. You know what I'm saying? So, 
you're automatically almost a target, you know what I'm saying, for the police. If they just want to mess with somebody or, or they ain't seen nobody, they wonder why you're out and this and that and the third, blah, blah, blah. They act like the judge, the jury, and everything in between. Got QT. Let's see if we can focus in, baby. But, man, that's, that's just messed up my day. Like, come on, man. Like, you're not into fitness if you ain't consistent. And, you know what I'm saying? Just like dieting, if you're gonna lose weight, you have to be consistent on your diet. You gotta be hitting the amount of calories every day. I bet you this dude gonna come to my car if I stop right here. I know people, man. You get on my nerves, man. Comment, like, subscribe. Holler back at your boy. You gotta be ready for everything. You gotta be ready to fight, do whatever. But holler at your boy. Don't I did, coming out at this time ain't for everybody, but I don't even recommend it. But um. I'll catch y'all on the next one, man. Peace.